And some news just coming in after rousing welcome for the Prime Minister in Russia. What really is expected next is the big meeting between Prime Minister Narendra Modi and President Putin. Bilateral with Putin amid Russia-Ukraine war assumes a great deal of significance like we've been talking about, promote global governance reforms that's on the agenda and also remember Russia has rolled out the red carpet and this bilateral assumes a great deal of significance like we've been talking about given the context, given the situation that both countries, Russia and Ukraine, have found themselves in. Prime Minister Modi arrives for the 2024 BRICS summit in Russia's Kazan. Upon his arrival, the Prime Minister was greeted with Russian sweets at the airport. He first met with the Indian community following the international tradition. Russian dancers celebrated Indian culture and performed bhajans as they welcomed the Prime Minister. He is scheduled to hold bilateral talks with Russian President Vladimir Putin and is going to be focusing on key global issues. However, uncertainty surrounds a potential meeting with China's President Xi Jinping. Remember, the summit is taking place against the backdrop of the ongoing Russia-Ukraine war and escalating tensions in the Middle East. Putin has expressed his appreciation for India's support in seeking peaceful resolutions, calling Modi a friend and acknowledges concerns regarding the conflict. Ambassador, what do we expect from the Prime Minister's visit? What's top on his agenda? Uh, the, uh, Prime Minister's visit uh, is taking place for participation in the 20, uh, 16th uh, BRICS summit. And uh, there are a number of issues that BRICS is uh, handling uh, today. Uh, economic development, uh, furthering economic cooperation between the member states, uh, in uh, cooperation for uh, reforming the global institutions, including the Security Council, uh, giving greater voice to the global south, uh, uh, handling climate change, the, uh, these are uh, some of the most prominent issues that uh, the leaders are expected to discuss during the summit. Uh, as far as India and Russia are concerned, the Prime Minister was here in July and then he subsequently travelled to Ukraine. Uh, he's met both the presidents. Is there some forward movement or likely forward movement uh, on exploring a roadmap for peace in the region? Uh, well, uh, the issue uh, has been uh, discussed and uh, spoken about. As you uh, know, India has uh, consistently held the view that uh, the concerned parties need to engage and find uh, a resolution to this conflict by uh, dialogue and diplomacy. Uh, so uh, I cannot prejudge what the leaders will talk, but uh, I won't be surprised if this issue is also discussed. Prime Minister Modi's government has always acted in national interest, consistently. And one has noted that the Congress party and its comments of politicizing even national issues of security has been consistent. Take the China issue. Mr. Rahul Gandhi was seen secretly meeting the Chinese ambassador when incursions were taking place in a part of India. No explanation why. Then a cover-up took place. Prime Minister Narendra Modi's arrival sparked excitement among both the Indian diaspora and the Russian locals there. The Indian community cheered for Prime Minister Modi while Russian dancers embraced Indian culture by performing traditional dances and singing bhajans as the Prime Minister arrived. Uh, how, do, how was it performing for the Prime Minister? It was very excited. <laughs> we were so nervous. Uh, how were you nervous? Because we rehearsed this dance about three months and now is the time to show it. We were all so nervous. You were? You yeah, were. Nervous. Did you enjoy? Did you yes. When did you start learning the Indian dance? Uh, when I was four years, my mom uh, decided me to Indian dance in our town. So now I'm dancing. What all, what all dances do you know? What all Indian dances do you know? Uh, what all Indian dances do Kathak, we know? Uh, Kathak, Bollywood, Garba, Karata Natya, Kuchipudi. How many of you have been to India? Have you been to India? No, no. What? We also want to. We really want go to India. Go to India. Please. Kazan में जो नया consulate खुल रहा है, उससे आप लोग का क्या लाभ होगा? वे consulate इतना महत्वपूर्ण क्यों है? भारत सर देखिए हमें कोई भी immigration या और किसी भी काम के लिए
उसको जाने की जरूरत नहीं पड़ेगी वो हम कजान में ही रह के कर सकते हैं और ये हमारे लिए बहुत लाभदायक हुआ क्योंकि हम लोग स्टूडेंट हैं और स्टूडेंट के लिए समय बहुत महत्वपूर्ण होता है जी हमारे समय को बचाएगा क्या उत्साह है जो आपको अपने शेड्यूल से अलग यहाँ लेकर आता है आप मुझे बताइए आपका उद्देश्य क्या है अभी तो बस मोदी जी को देखना हम सुबह से सात बजे से इधर आए हुए हैं और मैं अभी सिक्स तेर में हूँ लकीली इस साल मुझे मिल जाए मिल रहा है मोदी जी को मिलने मिलने का मौका सर तो आई एम वेरी हैप्पी फॉर इट